Good day Taurus and welcome to my channel. This is your weekly reading for January 15th to the 21st. If you're new here, welcome. If you're coming back, well, welcome back. I hope you're all doing well and I hope this reading resonates with you. Universe speak. Spirit's guide. What needs to be known? What lessons need to be learned? Ten of Diamonds. Six of Diamonds. Four of Spades. And, oh, the Joker. Okay. So, you have a positive risk ahead of you. Uh, a leap of th faith that you can take. And um, the cards say it's all good. Uh, you just need to plan and prepare. Uh, now, you might be looking back at your past. You see the weight back here and how he's looking back? The weight there is his past trying to hold him back, trying to weigh him down. Uh, so there's probably quite a few people that don't want you to take this leap of faith. This leap of faith can be uh, a new job, a new relationship, uh, a new place to live. You might actually be taking a risk to, to move somewhere far away. Uh, or all of the above. It could be a whole new life because, I mean, this is the zero card, you know. This is innocence. This is, like, new. It's brand new. It's a new beginning for you. Um, but the card, but the sun, which represents in the, uh, the fool card, uh, it's pointing forward. It's telling you to go forward. It's telling you to take that leap, ride that bike right off the edge, and, and see what happens with this new thing in your life. I feel like there's nothing left for you in the past. I feel like it's it's been became stagnant, you know, much like the weight. You know, it's just sitting there, but still people want you to sit there with it. Uh, but you need to you need to take the risk and, and go forward. Just plan and prepare, you know. Um, at the beginning of the week, uh, you have a chance to make it rain. Yeah, success uh, through unpleasantness. But you see, you got to go through that unpleasantness, uh, which would be your comfort zone. It's nothing like too crazy. It's just you got to leave your comfort zone. Like say if... Uh, you're not really into golfing, but a friend of yours uh, invites you to go golfing, and that's just unpleasant to you because you're not really into it. Well, you might want to go golfing because it's going to lead you to success. It's going to lead you to abundance, you know. Uh, so, yeah, you need to just step out of your comfort zone uh, here at the beginning of the week or throughout the whole week and um, really, you know, make it rain. You know, we don't, we don't usually have change in our lives if we don't leave our comfort zone if we just sit in our comfort zone everything will just stay the same it's not going to change you know um we have to leave our comfort zone for a moment to uh really get change in our lives and this is going to be big change this is going to be success so i mean you know if we're you know just talking about golf here say you're at you know the golf course and you meet somebody that you know is interested in something that you do and you know they want to help you you know make it successful that that's how this works um in the middle of the week uh you may feel confused and misled but the fact of the matter is is that you're not confused uh somebody might be misleading you uh causing you to feel confused but you're not you know exactly what you're talking about you know what you're doing uh you need to recheck your facts now this can be in any part of your life this can be in your work your business whatever um but yeah, you need to recheck your facts, you know, recheck, you know, your steps because you're not confused. You know what you're talking about. Um, and possibly somebody is causing you to think this way or it's just your own mind playing tricks on you. Uh, at the end of the week, uh, you're going to be lonely and you're possibly depressed. And if you have a partner, you might have disappointment in that partner at this point in time. And the cards say to search elsewhere, you know, like don't search within yourself and don't search, you know, in your partner to, uh, you know, figure this out. What you need to do is you need to search in a good friend, uh, somebody that, you know, if you tell them the truth, they'll tell you the truth. You know, they won't sugarcoat stuff for you, uh, but they're also, you know, not... Uh, really mean about it either uh this person also might have a lot to do with music 
because you also want music, entertainment, positive music and entertainment in your life at this point in time that you might find messages in. Uh, don't don't linger on sad or angry uh, music or entertainment at this point in time because that's just going to get you stuck there in that lonely, depressed feeling, you know. Uh, you want to listen to positive, more upbeat type music. Now, that doesn't mean that, you know, you have to listen to, like, uh, pop music or whatever. You can listen to metal. There's 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 positive metal music out there and whatnot. And you can listen to rap. There's positive rap out there, too. I know it's few and far between, but it's out there. Trust me. I listen to it all the time. So, uh, search elsewhere in entertainment, and uh, you should find your answer. Uh, to how to get past this loneliness and this depression. Uh, let's go ahead and see if the tarot card's got anything more to talk about this. Universe speak. Spirit's guide. What needs to be known? What lessons need to be learned? Mm. Yeah. Uh, you have the Knight of Pentacles, so slow and steady, you know, like the, the, the like the turtle, turtle, tortoise and the hare. Slow and steady wins the race, and I feel like that's I think because the Joker is your main card, and that means that it's going to be throughout the whole week. I think uh, planning and preparing for the leap of faith that you're going to take, uh, take it slow. You know, you'll you'll get the field plowed uh, just fine. Um, but yeah, this is slow energy, slow, uh, progressive energy. You know, it, 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 there is progress in, in being slow at times. And being a Taurus, I'm sure that you know how to work that, you know. But yeah, be slow and steady when you're planning and preparing for this leap of faith. Uh, go slow and steady when you're leaving your comfort zone, you know. Just pretty much slow energy, but progressive, you know. And uh, you should be just fine. But yeah, it's going to be some slow energy, but it'll get there. Uh, the things that you want to get to, you'll get to it. So there you go. I uh, hope this resonates and I hope it helps. And if it does, hit that like button. And if you would, please comment, share, and subscribe. I hope to see you back here next week. And until then, stay safe, stay mindful, and stay healthy.